what's happening in Central Texas with Kirk Kerkowian, and we have a very unique artist today on the show. We've only had one other artist like this ever in the history of what's happened in Central Texas, and yes, it's our second time ever have a rapper, and we're really privileged to have the one and only the kid. Hey, what's happening, man? How you doing? How you what are you doing? up to? Oh man, not much, man. Just been working, writing, getting ready to do the album. Just release another mixtape, and just you know, staying busy. Yeah. Uh, I I gotta ask you, the the people that don't know you, why do they call you the kid? Um, uh, I got the name. It, it came from a a good friend of mine. Uh, his name is actually uh Neek Knuckles, and he got his name from being good at basketball. But uh. I was always the youngest of who I ran with whenever I first started getting into actually hip hop and you know all that. So I was always the kid of the group. So that's how I got my name, and it originated with K I Double the Kid, and just throughout the years just shortened it to just going by the kid. So I thought it's because you look like you're 13 or 14. Well, probably yeah. <laughs> Hey, I give, all right, I'll give you 16. I, I, I like eating off the kids' menus. They're cheaper. <laughs> do you really? Do no, you still no. <laughs> do you get carded when I, you go out? I, I like, yeah. Uh, yeah, I still do. It makes me feel good, but a lot of places they they already know me, so it's 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 kind of yeah. it doesn't matter. So and after being on this show, you're gonna even be more known. Uh, maybe <laughs> I hope so. You know. Hey, something really exciting happened a few weeks ago here in Central Texas. Yeah. And I think this is the first time in uh, MACT that this has happened. Isn't that true? Yeah. All right. Would you want to tell us about the first award that you received? Um, the 2012 Songwriter of the Year Award. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Wow, that is a huge accomplishment yeah. to be Songwriter of the Year of all of them here in Central Texas. Yeah, and also to be a rapper and win it. I know that's... I mean, especially, not, not only that, but there's just so many talented people that's in this, this area whether it be songwriting, playing an instrument, or anything, you know, like, I grew up playing drums, I've, I've been, I got my first drum set when I was three years old, I grew up in music, so, you know, it, like I said, to be surrounded by so many, so much talent in this, in this area, it's, it's, it's cool, you know what I'm saying, it's, yeah. it's a great honor to, to be, you know, looked at at your peers, is accepted as, as a songwriter, especially being a hip-hop songwriter. Right. Well, you gave a very uh, good speech that night, you know, at the award ceremony. And do you remember what you exactly said, or you just went uh, your no, heart? No, I, I don't really remember, because uh, honestly, I didn't think I was going to win. Uh, really? I, yeah, I, I had no clue. I, I figured it would go to somebody else, so I didn't prepare for that. Uh, so it was kind of, it took me by surprise whenever it happened. But, you know, basically, i just like to thank everybody that, that voted and, yeah. and, and, and that that is a fan that listens to my music, that actually accepts my music, you know, I said, I'm here to, as part of the MACT organization, to change the face of, of hip hop and, and let you know that we're not all bad, we're not all, no. you know, we're not all hoodlums, you know, we may look a certain part, we may look a certain way and stuff like that. That's, that's an image. That's an image, yes, but it, you know, they expect you, to you know, I'm, I'm, I'm very much the same as anybody else, you know, I put my pants on the same yeah. way anybody else does and you know, I, I even though I, you know, people know me as the kid. I still get up every morning at five in the morning and go to work yep. and, and 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 hustle and grind to do what I got to do to provide for me and my family. Plus, you're expecting twins. Yes. Congratulations, so, man! You know what you're yeah. getting yourself into. Yeah, twins. it's woo doggy. Yeah, it's just kind of, they, <laughs> not they, one but two. Yeah, well, they kid. run. They they run in my family. Is so the kid we, one, kid two? I don't know. We we <laughs> we actually find out. In a couple of weeks, what they're going to be. Really? Yeah, so we're, I'm sure we're, it'll be on Facebook. We're, we're, yeah, we're pretty, yeah, it'll be on Facebook. Well, speaking Definitely. of two, you have things, I guess, in two all the time. You're having twins, and you walked away at MACT with actually two awards. Yeah. You also received, what award is this? Da 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 da! <laughs> Hip Hop Artist of the Year. Look at that! that that's awesome, kid. Yeah. I mean, not too many artists walked away with two. No. Like I said, like, I didn't, I didn't uh, really expect the songwriters. Uh, Hip Hop Artist of the Year, I've won it the last three years in a row. This year, I mean, the first year was cool, second year was cool. Yeah. It kind of, it's losing its cool because there needs to be. I, There's I'm not enough room on your wall is what you're saying there. It's well, actually enough. I'm running out of room on my studio shelf, but you know, there's, <laughs> there's always wall. But no, it just, I want to, I want to open up the eyes to everybody, like I said, and let everybody know that there is some great talent as yeah. far as hip-hop and stuff like that, 
And, uh, you know, just just because I do rap doesn't mean I only do rap. You know, I, I write pop songs. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I'll write anything with anybody. I mean, if anybody wants to write, you know what I'm saying? I'd, well, I'm you know, watching your, your videos that you have on your Facebook. Facebook and yeah. I've really, I mean, admire your type of writing skills because I could never do it. And there's a lot of people out there that couldn't. But you're a very unique artist. I mean, you're not a typical... No, I'm not a... Well, well what most people around here... Uh, as far as rap goes, they you know they try to keep the hardcore image and stuff like right. that. Where I'm more like I'll write about my feelings. You know, if I'm in if I'm in love or if I'm in disgust or I don't try to limit myself to to my writing. I try to you know there's there's days that I might go in the studio and be like you know what I'm gonna write about uh, a breakup and, it, and you know it, and there's some things also that I put myself in other people's shoes that I've talked to people and been like you know. I know what you're coming, what you're talking about, but when I write, I write it from my perspective, and I put me instead of them. Yeah. And you know, it, it's good as a writer to sit there and you know, you learn from some, you learn from somebody every day right. through life experiences, from what they've been through. And you know, I've been through so much in, in my, you know, my young years of being being alive, and you know, it's it's just a lot to write about, and and. It's fun. Yeah. I mean, it, it's good stress reliever. Most people want to go hit a golf ball. Most people want to go do this, do that. I, mine is playing hockey and, and drums and writing music. That's awesome. That's awesome. Now, you brought a video we're going to yeah. watch. Let's watch that video come back and let's talk a little. All right. Let's watch the great video. Fighting has got me going insane I know you don't like it, baby, when I come home late But I'm out getting this money to put food on the plate Your friends telling you lies, but their stories are fake They don't want to see you happy, they want to be in your place So wipe the tears from your face, there's no need for this We just wasting our time, give me a hug and a kiss Let's sit and reminisce about the times that we had We can talk about it all, yeah, the good and the bad You make me happy when I'm sad, bring out my good and my bad We can work our problems out, I'm trying to make this last And as we look and that was quite a video. Now, where was that taken at? Uh, just just around uh, Waco, Texas, uh, on top of it was a bank. I can't remember. I think it's the old Wells Fargo. Oh, okay. I thought I recognized it. Yeah. And uh, some little in Cameron Park, and then shot it at a buddy of mine's friend's house. Uh, they let me uh, use their wow. their uh, their bedroom. So that was you know. And uh, shout outs to uh, Whitney Garcia. She uh -huh. played uh, played the female role in there. Now, are you going to uh, do a rap song, do you think, for your twins? Oh, probably, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Definitely, yeah. most definitely. That's, and, I mean, I, like I said, I'm, insp I'm inspired by everything that goes on in my life. If you were to sit here and listen to my catalog of all my music, you'll, you'll, you'd get to know me pretty well. So are, are you going to have a song about what's happened in Central Texas when you leave out here? No, <laughs> that guy in Southern yeah. L. <laughs> yeah, that might be, the that one might with be. the Hawaiian shirt now. Yeah. But uh, now, where do you see yourself going with this? Tell, do you want to be more a songwriter, an artist? Where do you want to take uh, well, this? Well, actually, when, when I first started doing, as, as far as hip-hop music and stuff like that, I started out just as a producer, just as making beats oh. and running the studio, you know. But um, when I first got into hip-hop, really, there, was, there wasn't a lot of, you know, I'm not, there wasn't a lot of white people in it, you know. There, you know, everybody was just finding out uh, Paul Wall was white. Everybody right. thought everybody had to rap like Eminem, Slim Shady. The, you right. know, there was no Scott Storches back then. There was no J.R. Rodham's, uh, E.J. Epperson's. There was no producers like that. So like a lot of cats were taken back by that. We're like, no, nah, we're not, we're not, we're not messing with the white boy. And you know, so that they gave me drive and that gave me mm -hmm. something to to push for. And so I sat back on my little old computer with my Fruity Loops like five, I think it was back then, yeah. and Magics and Acid 4.0. And all those programs and just started making beats and writing myself. I was like, you know what, I've, I've been through a lot in my life that I think I have some stuff to write about. You know, it may not all be your typical gutter street rap, cause, but that's not my right. style. But, you know, and that, that's really what got me into it. And then it just developed into growing and growing and finally people recognizing the talent and, and, and wanting to work with me. And, you know, going out there and saying, hey, I like what you're doing. I got this track. I'd like for you to feature on it. I'd like for you to rap on it. I'd like for you to, and, and just, you know, you just work with, work with other, other people. And I mean, that's the best way is to build your, right. build your name is work with other people that have a name and build a name together even more. And, you know, so that's just pretty much how it came about. Now you have a, a website. Yes. 
And that is? It's the kidbaby.com. Kidbaby.com. Well, yeah. Actually, this way. Yeah. And then your Facebook. Actually, that's where I first met you. Yes. Was actually on Facebook. And I heard from numerous people, you've got to meet Kid. So actually, one of the other artists locally, he's, he said, you know, how they invite people. Mm -hmm. They said, you need to be friends with Kid. That's how I actually, mm -hmm. and then we started chatting online. So that's how I first saw your, your music. And so... If they want to find you on Facebook and get the same unique experience like I did, what's your Facebook? Uh, Facebook.com slash It's The Kid Baby. Yeah. Every, everything is It's The Kid Baby except, uh, I mean, it's thekidbaby.com, which is I-T-S-T-H-A-K-I-D-D-B-A-B-Y.com. Uh, Twitter is at The Kid Baby. Uh, Facebook is at The Kid uh, is the kid, Facebook.com, The Kid Baby. Or... The easiest way to go to is go to itsthekidbaby.com. I have all the links right there. That's you easy. just push it, and you become a follower or a fan of my Facebook page. Uh, I do have a personal and a fan page. It'll send you to my fan page, but you'll be able to find my personal one through there. What I, I work them all. Um, other than that, you know, just working and working and working. Uh, like I said, just trying to get out there socially because, you know, I also have... Let no one forget. I also have my own iPhone and Android app. No, you don't. Yeah. If you if you search the You're kid, kidding. if you search the kid in your marketplace or your app store, it'll be a free download app where you can stay in touch with me through everything that I do right there, and it's all free. Wow. Uh, I did not know this. Yeah, I'm actually downloading over 13 countries. Well, I'm going to download you right after the show because <laughs> I didn't know I have an Android yeah. myself. Yeah. And I just switched, and wow, that's really impressive, man. Wow! Trying to get out there. Trying to get out there. You I don't. I don't. I want to go. Na I want to go globally, not just nationally. Well, this is global since we're you know online. Yeah. That I this mean, is... you never know who's actually. We have people from all around the world actually watch what's happening in Central Texas, even though we're just on this. It's amazing. Yeah. You know, that's what we're trying to do. Is well, like I said. I mean, I know. I know. Just today, just on Twitter, I probably got five, six people just from London follow me. And, you know, if, I mean, if you, check wow. my, if you check my Twitter feed today, I gave a shout out to all my overseas followers. That's awesome. You know, so, and, you know, I, those, those, those cats over there, they're, they're very loyal. Yeah. And, you know, they're, you know, they're very ready to hear what's coming up next. They're, they're always waiting on a new project. And I just yeah. dropped a project two weeks ago, uh, Don't Talk, Just Listen, which is uh, more girl-based. Mm -hmm. um, but like I said, if you go to itsthekidbaby.com, I have three mixtapes that are there that are for free download. You just click a button, click the, click the uh, the cover, yeah. and download straight from there. Wow! And listen to the music. And I'm starting on my album project, which will be on iTunes, Amazon, Spotify, all that. Uh, that's actually in production right now. That's awesome, man. So, and that's what's. You know, trying to I'm trying to get it all in before these twins get here because I know that <laughs> you're gonna be busy. You know, my, my time will be limited, but you you'll know. have a backup band though. Yeah, yeah, I hope so. <laughs> hey, kid, it's been a real pleasure having right. you on. You too. Yeah. Appreciate it. Yeah. Well, anyway, as always, be nice, be kind, and get some work today. Until the next show, we are out of here. I guess we're out this way. Uh, some way. See you all later. That's Carpatway Furniture in downtown Waco. We're left on the corner and right on the prize. I've seen a lot of places. I've been around the world.